if you frequently say it, Allah would pay off your debts. And this dua we have already explained before in hadith number 121. So you can refer to it back again, inshallah. The hadith goes as follows. Allahumma inni a'udhu bika min al-hammi wal-hazan wal-ajizi wal-kasal wal-bukhli wal-jub wadala'i al-dayni wa ghalabati al-rijal. Oh Allah, I take refuge in you from anxiety and sorrow. And we said that al-ham wal-hazan, that it translates to what worries you in the future and what griefs you in the past. Weakness and laziness, and we said there in Hadith 121, weakness is not the appropriate word. The appropriate word would be incapacity or inability and laziness. Miserliness and cowardice, the burden of debts, and this is why it's good for paying off your debts, because you're seeking refuge in Allah from the burden of debts and from being overpowered by men.